Jacksepticeye and welcome to Jack Curves a Jack O' Lantern! The, the Jacks combine! We're gonna continue the Halloween trend and I decided I was gonna get a pumpkin and then I was actually gonna try and carve it and see what it turned out like and I'm sorry for the awful, awful audio in here. It's really bad for a person who shouts all the time because it's very- <coughs> Woo! It's very echoey in here. It sounds like there's about 10 of me in here. But I, I wanted to do this because I thought it'd be funny and I got like the nicest pumpkin that I could out of the shop and it still looks like shit. It's all like speckled and freckled and the back of it is even worse because it's all dirty and brown. And this is the best one out of the shop. So I wanted to carve a face into it. I don't know what kind of face I want to carve into it. I'm just going to rub it for a while. This is what you got to do when you're prepping up a pumpkin. When you got to do it, when you got to carve a pumpkin, you got to rub it all over first. It's, it's, a, it's a genie action. You got to get the magic out. It's Halloween, baby. Two cameras for this. One there, but I set up two of them just in case I needed to. Um, I have no idea where to start with this. This is going to take a while because I'm going to have to carve out your insides. I'm going to have to empty your head. <sighs> also, did you know that carving jack-o'-lanterns actually originated in Ireland? Um, apparently. That's what Wikipedia said. I have no idea. I don't know if that's true or not. Apparently we used to carve turnips. But, um, we're going to get into this and I'm going to start by chopping off your head. Sorry, bro. Oh, it feels good. Oh, it gets all, all of the badness out. Just stabbing the shit out of a pumpkin like this feels amazing. That did not go the way I wanted it to. Oh okay. god. Me around sharp knives? Yeah, prepare to see some blood. You're gonna to wanna to have the best of tools. Just the nicest of knives, serrated, um, gigantic, smaller, even smaller. You're gonna want a spoon, you're gonna want a hat. If you don't have a hat, then you can't do it because that's just science. He who tries to carve a pumpkin with it without a hat on is just is just pissing in the wind. Come up, you bitch! Oh, that knife is gonna break. <laughs> Careful. Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh god. Oh Jesus. Ew. Ew. <laughs> you just need a bag to empty his brains into. <laughs> brains. Brains. I'm gonna make pumpkin soup after this. Not really, I'm lying to you to make myself sound cooler and to make it seem like I actually had a plan for carving a pumpkin. I literally did it because I had nothing else to do. <laughs> and then you put that down for later because that's his little hat. Look at the inside of him. It's so gross. Ew. It smells disgusting as well. <laughs> now begins the scoopage. Now you stick your spoon in and you just razzle dazzle his brains. Oh, just get right in there. Right in there and fucking shim, 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 shim. Be gentle when you're scooping out his brains. When you, when you go in with the spoon, don't go too hard because you might hurt him, you might hurt yourself so you gotta be careful with it. Just, oh, give it, give it a nice smell. Oh. Shh, shh, go to sleep, shh, go to sleep. Oh, it's all sticky and gross. Why did they do that? No wonder you couldn't talk, your head was full of seeds. There's your problem. After you've given your pumpkin a lobotomy, take a second to appreciate your handiwork. Look inside the pumpkin's head and admire the amount of emptiness that's inside it. Try to put it on your own head. Fail miserably. It hurts. Ow! You feeling good there, boy? It's very rubbery. Okay, now that you have a bongo drum, it's time to start putting a face on this bad boy. You have a serious case of acne going on, but well, we're going to fix that. We're going to smooth you all down, we're going to carve out some holes where your head will be. Um, okay, I'm going to go stereotypical pumpkin on this now. Okay, you listening to me? I'm going to put some eyes on him, like the, the slanted kind of eyes, the angry looking face. That's what I'm going to do. I should probably draw it on before I do anything, because I'm going to mess this up. Take special attention to that, because that's not how it's going to look when I'm finished with it, okay? So you just, you stick a knife right in his eye, and if he screams, just shh, just shh, there you go, there you go, oh, go to sleep, go to sleep. You gotta calm your pumpkin down sometimes before you go chopping their face off, okay? I mean, pumpkins are people too. Ah, <laughs> Oh, get that knife good and deep in there. Oh, sure, it's just like, it's just like carving up an orange football. Where the hell is your nose? Where's the nose part? Oh, there it is, I see it. I see it, come on. Why didn't I cut you properly? Here you go, here you go, you want another slice of action? You want another slice of life? You're not gonna get that because you're gonna die now soon. Stab you in the nose. Why won't the nose pack come out? There we go. Oh, nice. Now can you breathe? Fine, fucking complaining all this time. I mean, what do you want from me? I'm just a person. Now we go for the mouth. I like to think of myself kind of like a pumpkin dentist. You just, you just smack him in the face and then he's fine. Oh God, I shouldn't have done that. Now you have a big scar on the side of your face. Damn it. Okay. <laughs> now, if you're young or at home alone, always get the help of an adult. Don't do this 
on your own unless you're a qualified professional like I am. Because Spider-Man don't want to come and try and save your ass from no goddamn cuts on the hands. I mean, my web fluid is only good for sticking to walls. It's not good for cauterizing, or I don't know why you'd cauterize with web, because it's fucking, it's not fire. Um, let's see if we can get this mouth out. Oh, 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 there's some of your teeth out. Some of your dentures. <laughs> yeah, fuck. And there you have your derpkin. I mean, pumpkin. He's not a derp. He's really cool. So would you would you believe that it was my head if I wasn't standing here holding him? <laughs> Didn't he look cool? Okay, we have to get, we have to rub off all the marker first, actually, because with the marker on you, I can't really see where your head is. Give me some of that pumpkin juice. Now we gotta give you some eyebrows. These are a very intricate piece of the pumpkin, because you gotta be careful. If you do them too deep, you gotta do it like you were like um, tweezing some eyebrows. You gotta do it gently. You gotta do it gently, and oh god, your whole eye is coming off. There we go. Nice, bro. Nice one. You having fun? Good boy. And there you have it. A pumpkin fit for a king. If kings were into pumpkins. Kings were into pumpkins, right? What fucking way does this go on? You gotta rotate your little hat until it fits back onto his head. There we go. <laughs> there you have your pumpkin. Look at him, all menacing and evil and shit. It's a bit too big. <laughs> I wanted him to be smaller. Oh, I need to get a candle for him. I actually have a candle lying around. <laughs> Let's go get it. Stick my little candle in there. Oh god, you're all lopsided. There we go. Okay, now how the hell do I light you? Can I come in from the front? There we go. Nope. That's a fire hazard. Don't do that at home. Please. And there you go. Your candle is inside your pumpkin. And it all looks nice and dandy. Spooky scary skeletons and shivers down your spine. It actually looks pretty cool in the dark. <laughs> video on jacko carving jackos this was fun to do i actually didn't know what to do i wanted to keep the halloween stuff going and i didn't want to just do games all the time and i like doing these kind of stuff outside of games where you get to just hang out and enjoy some time with me <laughs> this was fun i really liked it we need to give a name to this guy people in the comments give him a name i guess jacko is a pretty easy thing to do or sam or billy people are going to say but we need a cool name for him let's call him baldy no <laughs> but anyway Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, punch the like button in the face, like a boss, and I face on rock. Whoosh, whoosh. But thank you guys, and I will see all your nudes in the next video. It's oh, more circulicious. Here we go. Here we go. I leave a little shine in your eyes, Sam. Nailed it. <laughs> there, there you go, Sam. You're, you're all done. <laughs> um, sure, yeah. Um, okay, what's this is gonna sound terrible when I edit it because oh, it's just echo everywhere. I, my neighbors probably hear me so much louder down here. <laughs>